And now to the players, ladies and gentlemen, a household name who's had a love affair with the snooker public for many years and who could deny this fabulous star another opportunity to become king of the world. Ladies and gentlemen, on to centre stage, will you welcome the world number three, the whirlwind of London town, Jimmy White. <laughs> And his opponent, one of the big success stories, the history of snooker, and at 23 years of age, he's won everything the game has offered, and this brilliant young Scott is attempted to win the title for the second time in three years. Will you welcome into the final, the world number one from Scotland, Stephen Hendry. all the players together for the traditional pre-final photographs with the great old 65 year old trophy the original trophy paid for out of the entry fees from the first ever championship One. An inch the other way, it was end of break. frames to eight. Went boldly for Thank it. You. Quiet, please. He's never looked like missing a potable ball that he's taken on. 28. When things have gone wrong. Well, I think perhaps that was one of the times he should have done. Jimmy White. Yes. One. Nine. Twenty-three. Twenty-five, Stephen Hendry. Henry. The anxiety showed in the slight body movement. I suppose it was inevitable that we had to have one. One. Thirteen. 
So that should 20. see the frame to Stephen. But... 35 and the Meanwhile, Stephen Hendry has taken the 23rd frame. But Jimmy White still leads by 14 frames to nine. One. Foul. One. Stephen Hendry. Open the reds. One. Fifteen. Forty-two. Forty-two. Jimmy White. One. Seventeen. Hendry tried to develop the pink with his previous shot. And that's why he's the number one in the world. Wonderful shot. He was almost certainly going to be six frames behind at the interval. But he potted it. <laughs> and with that resolute 64 clearance, Stephen Hendry wins the last frame of the afternoon. Jimmy White, though, leads by 14 frames to 10. So close. Eight. Stephen Hendry. Close enough. Fifteen. Get back to the black from this red. Now, has he gone 16. through far enough? Oh, that's a cracker. Now, can he utilize One. the yellow? He looks to be. My word, that uh, seemed Jimmy to White. go into the pocket, but that is... And ditto repeato. That is unusual, and it says everything. I even go back for the pink in the same pocket. Twelve. Jimmy White. So it's back to Stephen. Take this frame. If it drops nicely. One. So 31 points ahead now, and this red will make frame safe. 24. Oh, and he's missed it. 24. Jimmy White. Very important frame, this opening frame. He's made it this time. And the perfect One. angle. Six. Twenty. Well, surely uh, Stephen can't miss this, so a frame. A 
very, very tough frame indeed. It's taken by Stephen Hendry. He pulls one back. 14-11. That's a ball that Steve Thank you. potted. One. But he attacked them. And then the position is all right. Thirty one. Nicely. But a little bit thin, not quite into them enough. 54. Leaving Stephen in a difficult position should he miss it. Now oh, that's... One. That's a great... Well, that's 37. Looks to be. This is a tough shot. Well played. Forty-five. Fifty-two. Stephen Hendry. So within two points of Jimmy White, Hendry. Oh, a great shot. One point behind. And my word, he took his time on a, what would be a simple thing, but what another frame to win. It's 14-12. He just 19, didn't Jimmy have White. the right angle Four. by about half an inch there and was forced to uh, take on a bold shot. And if Stephen can suddenly One. go up a gear, we could be in for something. Is onto the corner. If he makes this red, he can position onto the black. One. Twenty-four. Got to see from our position. But this will free the other red when he moves it. Twenty-five. Don't appear to be on for any pocket. Fifty-six. Oh, is he lucky? Is he on one of the two reds? Fifty-six. So the frame conceded by Jimmy White, and it goes to Stephen Hendry. He is now one frame behind. Well, he has a red. And there we are. This young man is beginning to flow. One. 22.
23. 31. Well, the bump of the centre cushion helped there. And that surely is going to be a frame winner. For Stephen, he's refused to take that red till now. applause there and what a treat this 117 <laughs> a mistake by Stephen <laughs> 17 well, 17, Jimmy White. Seventeen. Two hundred. Is that red going out of the middle pocket? Jimmy doesn't fancy it. He's going for the other one. Possible in a minute, Ted, when he gets this colour. Oh dear. Five, Jimmy White. Stephen hit it. An amazing performance then by the world's number one star, Stephen Henry. He's won the last seven frames and now leads 15 frames to 14. Taking the more difficult red, the one near the cushion. That's always the danger. 14, Jimmy White. <laughs> 25. Jimmy's again in trouble. Consecutive frames. The pink drops in, and he's leading by two frames at 16 frames to 14. Oh, this young man's in. He's liable to knock this one in. One. Fourteen. Forty-four. The break now 
65. 65. Yet another one. And it must be terrible for 30-year-old Jimmy White oh, and nine consecutive frames. No. Well, the one Five. thing I didn't think about was him missing the black Ted that... Uh, it's on for nine. The rest 17. are all out in the open. Thirty. Fifty three. Always in my mind on these occasions, it seems a pity after such magical snooker 54. that someone has to lose. So just one more red required and to really 66. put it beyond doubt. Just the last red now. 86. World's number one star. Completing ten frames. He becomes the 1992 Embassy World Champion for a second time as Jimmy steps forward to shake his hand. And what a miraculous performance by a 23-year-old boy from Scotland. Stephen Hendry, if you walk forward, please. And you will for this. A check for £150,000 and more important, the trophy, Embassy Champion of the World, Stephen Hendry.